Hey guys, today I'm going to show you four social media open source intelligence APIs. Let's get right into this. So why would you want to use these APIs? The first reason is they are readily accessible for you. All these tools are hosted on a platform called Rapid APIs and you can just go on to Rapid API and start using these tools. The second thing is you can easily integrate these APIs into your software or your website by just copying and pasting a simple code. So let's explore these tools and let's see how you can use them for your OSINT investigations and business research. So the first one is called Social Media Data TT. And this API um, gets you data on social media users, posts, and hashtags. And it also does some stuff on music and trends. So let's try out this API and let's see some of the things it can do. So I'm going to click on this tab here to get um, a following list. And let's see if this API can pull out some of the following list of a user profile. So I'm going to try Elon Musk. Then we'll come over to this tab here and test endpoints. So it brings out some of the users um, Elon is following and it arranges it very nice in a JSON format. So let me check my own social media. And it brings out some of the people I'm following. And this is very accurate. This is a really good social media um, information gathering API. So yeah, that's social media data TT. Um, I'll put a link to this in the description. Check, go check this out. The second tool we are going to be looking at is fake users. So this API does a very simple thing. It generates a random identity for you and it goes into details, generates names, emails, passwords, addresses, and even credit cards. So let's say you're doing an OSINT investigation and you don't want to use your real identity. So you can just generate a fake identity and just have access to everything, a new name, passwords, emails, credit cards, and addresses. So let's check this out. So I'm just, you can get user by gender, a male or female, or you can just generate a random user. So let's just try to generate a random user. And you see the results right here. So gender, female, so this is the detailed name of the user, an email, a phone number, even a picture. So you can just copy this and check. Let's see how this person looks like. Just going to copy this picture. Yeah, that's the user we generated. So all this information is very detailed and you can just use this to generate a new identity and use in your OSINT investigation. So that's fake users. I'll put a link to this in the description. You should check this out. The next API we'll be looking at is Social Scanner. So what this does is it takes a username and checks through over 25 social media accounts to find if this user exists on those social media accounts. So let's put in, let's try Elon Musk again. And let's search this. So it shows us possible Elon Musk blog, it shows us a Facebook with some details, and it even shows us an Elon Musk Reddit account. So you can use this tool in your OSINT investigations. Let's say you are finding a missing person and you are trying to connect the dots to all this person's social media accounts, and you can use this to start getting your information down. And I made a full video on this, I'll leave a link to that in the description below. So this tool is very important for different things in business and 
um, OSINT investigations. So that's social scanner. Let's move on to the next API. The last API on this list is LinkedIn profile and company data. So what this tool does is it gets you information about a LinkedIn user or a company on LinkedIn. So you can use this tool to gather information about a potential business partner or a um, potential LinkedIn connection. Or if you just want to get information on any LinkedIn user or company, you can just use this tool to do that. So this is a very important tool focused on LinkedIn and you can just use that in your investigations or business research. Let's check out um, company employees, for example. I'll put in hail bytes and let's see what that gives us. So this gives us four items and uh, let's check this out. This is Hazel. That's me. Um, John and David. So this is a very, very accurate tool. And you can just use this to gather any information on LinkedIn. So those are four social media OSINT APIs you can start using for your investigations and you can start integrating into your business. So that will be all for today. If you enjoyed this video or you learned something from this, make sure you like and share the video. Don't forget to also subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow Hailbytes on LinkedIn. The link to that will be in the description below. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.